Hey, what's up? It's Wick for Xiaomi Fi, and today we're looking at the Xiaomi handheld vacuum cleaner. It's got a lot of similarities to another well-known line of vacuum cleaners, but is it any good? Let's find out. Let's go. In the box, you'll find the vacuum cleaner and a whole bunch of attachments, a charger and a wall mount. I've done the full unboxing in an episode of Mystery Box when they send me this vacuum cleaner. First out of the box, I'm impressed with how well this vacuum cleaner feels. It's really nicely designed and it looks great. The Xiaomi handheld vacuum cleaner has a 350 watt brushless motor, a 9 cone cyclone engine with 100 air watt suction speed, 5 different filters and a built in 2500 milliamp hour battery that's good for around 160 square meters of cleaning per charge. It comes with 4 different brush heads for cleaning the floor, cleaning the bed or sofa and for cleaning the edges of a room. On the back of the handle you'll find its charging port. You can just charge it by itself or have it mounted to the wall to charge which is actually not bad. Above that you'll find the indicator light which will show you the battery levels. On the handle you'll find the start button. Simply press to start vacuuming and let go to stop. On top of that handle you'll find the max button which you can reach with your thumb. If you press this together with the start button it will increase the vacuum strength by four times to max level. This is really a lot stronger but it also allows for much shorter vacuum cleaning time. The dust collector bin can be easily emptied with the switch on the bottom. Just press and it will dispose. You can actually take this whole dust collector bin off as well and all the filters and all the small elements inside as well. You can pretty much clean all of it with water except for the motor itself. It's actually very convenient and pretty easy to put back together as well. This vacuum cleaner comes with an extension rod and four different brush heads. You can either attach these with the extension rod or without the extension rod in between. The first of these attachments is this soft velvet electric brush that is motor powered. This one is great for cleaning the floors. The second is this electric dust removal hat which also rotates. It's got a much stronger and different type of brush. This is good for the bed and the sofa. The normal brush tip can be used for desks or laptops. And finally the gap tip is to vacuum in harder to reach places. The vacuum cleaner itself is only 1.5 kilograms or 3.3 pounds and it feels pretty lightweight. The first time I tried it I was both surprised by how lightweight it is and how low noise it is. This thing is really low noise at its normal vacuum speed. It might be hard to indicate the sound, but this is the sound compared to one of my old vacuum cleaners. And this is the sound compared to the Xiaomi vacuum robot. And you can see it's impressively silent. Now how well does it vacuum? Let's try it out with a whole bunch of stuff again. Here I've got a lineup of various rubbish including the contents of an ashtray, some cereals, some cat food, some torn up paper, some pastas and a whole bunch of cat hair that I got from a brush. <laughs> like that. I was again surprised at how well the suction power is. It's very strong, but it did not take on everything that well. I noticed it's really good for dust and smaller items. It handles the spices and the pasta and all that type of stuff very well. But trying to do the full content of two ashtrays together with the torn up paper was not a very good idea. I must say that for normal everyday cleaning, it is very good as you can see right here. Here I'm trying that on this floor mat and you can clearly see how strong it is when using this dust removal head. Which is great for things like this or on sofas or beds. In China, the Xiaomi handheld vacuum cleaner came out for 1200 RMB for the vacuum cleaner with the charging dock. In Europe, this Mi vacuum cleaner is also out for around 250 euros in countries like Spain, France and Italy. You can also find it through the international resellers to which I have put some links below. Now what do I think of the Xiaomi vacuum cleaner? Well I think it's very well priced, it's definitely great looking 
It's very strong. It is extremely low noise. It's lightweight. It's very portable. It's got a very good filtration system as I didn't notice anything coming out of the top. And it seems to perform very well. Besides not performing that well for this crazy amount of rubbish that I've thrown on the floor, it's actually good for daily use like normal dusting. I kind of would have loved to see a slightly bigger battery, but it is enough to do my whole apartment and probably most apartments in one go. So it's not really a big deal, but it would have been nice. Even if you already owned a Xiaomi vacuum robot, I think this still can be a great addition to uh, clean your stairs and clean the sofa and other things which the vacuum robot might not reach. So what do you guys think about the Xiaomi handheld vacuum cleaner? Let me know down here in the comment section what your thoughts are and if you have any questions. And don't forget to leave a little like below this video to show me that you liked it. And if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, know that you probably should as I'm doing a ton of videos about Xiaomi products and products from the Xiaomi ecosystem right here on the Xiaomi Fi channel. As always, thank you guys for watching and I hope to see y'all soon. Peace.